Install Heroes presents Safe Computing Best Practices. This list is intended to help ensure the integrity of your computer and data. A few of these items will be old news to some of you, but we feel it is important to share this list as a point of reference for our customers and blog readers. Utilize security software. Antivirus software offers real-time protection for downloads, emails, and suspicious website activity. Viruses aren't just a Windows problem either. People often think that Macs cannot get viruses. They're wrong. Macs can and do get viruses, but at a substantially lower rate of occurrence than Windows machines. Install Heroes recommends a vast antivirus for Macs and PCs. Your Mac and Windows-based computers also include a basic firewall. It is important to be sure this firewall is configured properly to be sure that no one can access your data remotely. Update software. It is important to keep your operating system, antivirus software, and all other programs up to date. Out-of-date software is more likely to have vulnerabilities which can be exploited. It should be obvious that you need to keep your antivirus software updated but it is equally important to keep your OS and other software updated as well. If hackers and malware creators find a way to exploit a program, such as Adobe Reader or Microsoft Word, and you don't keep them up to date, then your computer is at risk. Create stronger passwords. Password management company Splash Data has compiled a list of the top 25 most common passwords used in 2013. If your password is on the list, it's time to make a change. I suggest using a computer-generated password. Norton has an online password generator which can assist with creating a random password. Random passwords are great because there is no chance someone is going to guess your password just because they know information about you. It's also a bad idea to use the same password for every account. Back up. Ensure your system is backed up regularly. Whether you perform manual backups with an external hard drive, rely on automatic backup software such as a Cronus TrueImage, or backup to the cloud with a service like iDrive, it's important to be sure you have a backup plan in place. Having your files backed up will make your life much easier in the case of a hard drive failure, virus attack, or a lost or stolen computer. A manual backup can be as simple as dragging and dropping documents from your computer onto a flash drive. Be weary online. You should always be mindful of suspicious emails. Ignore unsolicited emails and never click on attachments or links in the email if you don't trust the source. Also, be careful to notice if the URL of a link is going to the correct web page. Simply hover over a link before clicking on it to see where it's going to take you. You should also be careful about where you go online. I suggest you stick with well-known, reputable websites, and I also suggest you stick with a secure web browser such as Google Chrome. Check out my post about browsers and how to protect yourself from pop-ups and malicious ads. Secure Disposal When it's time to upgrade to a new computer, it's also time to think about how you're going to dispose of your old computer. Depending on how much personal data you have, you may be concerned about someone getting access to the information on your old computer. One method to ensure the integrity of your data is to remove the hard drive from your old computer and keep it, or physically destroy it with a shredding service. Limit access. Whether you're at home, work, or out in public, you should never leave your computer unattended when logged in. You should always lock or log off your computer when you step away. If a malicious stranger, pranking coworker, or unwitting child gets access to your computer and documents, there's no telling how much trouble it could cause for you. Secure your router. It's especially important to secure your wireless router, and it's important to only use secured connections when away from home. In a best case scenario, you could be letting your neighbors mooch Wi-Fi for free, thereby slowing down your connection. In a worst case scenario, you could be opening yourself up to hackers and data thieves. Free software. There's no such thing as a free lunch, right? Well, that's not true with software. There is a lot of free software available for PCs and Macs. The problem is that there are a lot of untrustworthy freeware sites which may install rogue software on your computer. Mac users can check out getmacapps.com and Windows users can try ninite.com. 
Both sites allow you to check off all the software you wish to install. Then you download a single file, which seamlessly installs each program. The best part is that they also automatically opt out of all of the junk programs and toolbars, which often come with freeware programs. Keep informed. The best thing you can do to protect your computing experience is to stay up to date on security issues. Sites like commando.com often have the newest online security news. You can also like the Install Heroes Facebook page and we'll do our best to pass on important security news as well as tips and tricks, hot deals, product reviews, and general tech news. Also, be sure to check out the description of this video for links to the products and websites I mentioned here today.